Hello everyone. In this video, we discuss about what is symmetrical component. Before to start this topic, we also discuss about how three phase AC system is work. Here, the three phase AC system is directly connected with three phase load and suppose that this three phase system is in balanced condition when phase A sending current to load side it will return with phase B and phase C after a certain time period when current is sending from phase B to load side it will return with phase A and phase C after certain time period phase C se jab current flow hoga load side it will return with phase A and phase B this is the how three phase system AC is work and it is also understand by sinusoidal waveform The phase A is start with 0 degree, we know that and here in this angle sort of waveform, the phase A is start and it is uh, indicated by red color. Here after certain time period, it means after some milliseconds, the phase B is starting here phase B starting that is 120 degree after some millisecond and then after after some millisecond after certain time period the phase C is starting at 240 degree I am indicating here that is 240 degree that is 3 phase AC sinusoidal waveform we can see here when current is sending from phase A, the current from phase B and phase C, it is in negative and after certain time period at 120 degree, when current is sending from source to load side, at that time the current from A or C is in negative after certain time period at 240 degree phase C is starting in that duration the phase A and B is negative and we can see that at 90 degree the phase A attain maximum value at the uh, end after 120 degree phase B is attain maximum value and then after after 120 degree phase C attain maximum value it means the phase depression phase difference phase separation between A A to B is 120 degree and phase separation between B to C is 120 degree that is the how three phase system AC is work and it is also represented by vector form here I am indicating as voltage parameter here the voltage is the voltage VA, VB and VC if three phase system is balanced condition it means its magnitude is same and the phase displacement between each phase is VA to VB is 120 degree, VB to VC is 120 degree and VA to VC is 120 degree. Here we understand what is the phase displacement in three phase system and what is its magnitude and when it will start. That is the three phase AC system is work. Now we discuss the what is symmetrical component. Before this we discuss what is balance system and unbalanced system 
if the system is balanced the magnitude of all phases are equal and they are displaced by 120 degree to each other that is the main condition the magnet magnitude and phase displacement that is equal in all three phase and phase displaced 120 degree to each other but if some fault occurs then system becomes unbalanced if that is the system is not satisfied with this case magnitude are not equal or phase displacement are not 120 degree here we can see that that is unbalanced system here the phase displacement between all three phases are not same that is VA, VB and VC are not displaced by equal phase difference that is unbalanced system that is the difference between balanced and unbalanced balanced system may Harik phase ki value same hoti hai, equal hoti hai or Harik phase 120 degree phase displace hoga Again, unbalanced system it means agar koi fault hota hai to iski magnitude or phase dono disturb ho jate that is unbalanced system and this unbalanced system is represented by symmetrical component here what is symmetrical component why it will need symmetrical component it means it is represent unbalanced system to balanced system मतलब अनबैलेंस सिस्टम को हम अगर हमें बैलेंस सिस्टम में कन्वर्ट करना हो तो हम सिमेट्रिकल कंपोनेंट यूज करेंगे एंड देयर आर थ्री सिमेट्रिकल कंपोनेंट पॉजिटिव सीक्वेंस कंपोनेंट नेगेटिव सीक्वेंस कंपोनेंट एंड जीरो सीक्वेंस कंपोनेंट अनबैलेंस सिस्टम इज रिप्रेजेंटेड एज थ्री सीक्वेंस कंपोनेंट पॉजिटिव नेगेटिव एंड जीरो सीक्वेंस कंपोनेंट हियर देयर इज original unbalanced phasor VA, VB and VC and that is represented as three sequence component symmetrical component positive negative and zero sequence component positive sequence component ko hum one notation se indicate karenge negative ko two or zero ko zero se here the unbalanced phasor voltage is represented by symmetrical component VA1 plus VA2 plus VA0 unbalanced phasor voltage VB is equal to VB1 plus VB2 plus VB0 and VC is equal to VC1 plus VC2 plus VC0 अब हम तीनों तीन symmetrical component को definition के द्वार देखेंगे here the VA, VB and VC that is original unbalanced phasor and it is represented by positive, negative and zero sequence component. Let we discuss about positive sequence component. Three phasors equal in magnitude and displaced from each other by 120 degree in phase and having same phase sequence as original. And it is indicated by VA1, VB1 and VC1. That is the symmetric uh, positive sequence component. Here, the phase displacement in each phase is 120 degree and its magnitude VA1, VB1 and VC1. Positive sequence component may denote in phase ki magnitude same hogi or harik phase 120 degree phase displace hoga. And its phase sequence, phase sequence is same. Here, phase sequence is A, B and C. A, B and C. The phase sequence in positive sequence component is same as original unbalanced phasor VA1, VB1 and VC1. Now negative sequence component. In this component, the three phasors equal in magnitude. You know the phase ki magnitude same hogi and displaced by 120 degree each other. You know the phase ek dusre se 120 degree displaced honge. But the difference is the phase sequence. Here the phase sequence is A, C and B. That is the opposition of original unbalanced phasor. VA2, VC2 and VB2. That is negative sequence component. 
Now third one is zero sequence component. In this sequence component, the magnitude is equal V A zero, V B zero, and V C zero. But the displacement in each phases is zero. That is indicated by V A zero, V B zero, and V C zero. That is the symmetrical component, which is very important topic in power system. I am, I am. फिर से थोड़ा रिपीट कर लेते हैं जैसे कि थ्री फेज इस सिस्टम में अगर कोई फॉल्ट होता है तो सिस्टम अनबैलेंस हो जाती है तब हर एक फेज जो होता है वो डिस्टर्ब होता है मतलब अनबैलेंस हो जाता है तो अनबैलेंस सिस्टम को अगर बैलेंस सिस्टम में कन्वर्ट करना हो रिप्रेजेंट करना हो तो उसके लिए हम सीमेट्रिकल कम्पोनेंट थियोरी पढ़ेंगे और सीमेट्रिकल कम्पोनेंट कंटेंट थ्री कम्पोनेंट पॉजिटिव नेगेटिव एंड जीरो सिक्वेंस कम्पोनेंट इन पॉजिटिव सिक्वेंस कम्पोनेंट All phase magnitude is equal and displaced by 120 degree phase and phase sequence is original as unbalanced phase. Second one is negative magnitude is equal 120 degree phase displacement but the difference is the phase sequence is opposite to compared to original unbalanced phase and the zero sequence component is in which the magnitude is equal but the phase displacement is zero. So that uh, unbalanced phase V A is V A one plus V A two plus V A zero. V B is equal to V B one plus V B two plus V B zero, and V C is equal to V C one plus V C two plus V C zero. Next video, we will see symmetrical component from unsymmetrical phases. How to derive them, and on that basis, we will see one example. Thank you.